You have to come pretty far out of your way off the Jacksboro Highway to find Wizard Wells because it's not the big town it once was. In fact, only about a dozen families live here now. But that wasn't always the case. Around the turn of the century, this used to be the center of attention for people looking for magical cures. And if rebuilding plans go through for that place behind us, the legend of Wizard Wells may live again. The cures come from mineral baths, and the mineral baths started with this well dug in the 1880s by the town's founder. Old timers say the man was disappointed at first by the water until he discovered that bathing in it cured the sores on his legs. Well, word spread and hundreds flocked to mineral wells, among them Preach Morrow's grandfather. Temporarily in 1912, the wells dried up and the exodus began. The town died. The Morrows stayed, though. Preach is now in his 70th year and still lives in Wizard Wells, as does his son and grandson. He remembers the old days. Down here in the flat, the other people come in there and they camp out in the wagons and tents. And then they would uh, take baths here. And they'd bring them in here on the stretchers. In two weeks' time, they'd be walking everywhere. See, there was a hotel set right here. Then there's another big bathhouse right down there, and another big hotel on back out there little ways out there, three-story hotel. What's it like to watch a town be so big and then die out? What, how'd that make you feel? Oh, it makes a person feel bad. The town he raised up in. But Wizard Wells is trying to make a comeback. A man from Jacksboro named Jim Davis is refurbishing this old hotel and bathhouse and in five years hopes to build it into a total resort community. He's restoring the rooms now and plans to reactivate the old spa and water distillery. If he fails, well, you'll still have to search for the spot on the map. If he succeeds, at least Preach Morrow will be pleased. Because it's our old hometown, no, so I'd like to see it build up. Maury Dial, Channel 8 News in Wizard Wells, Texas.